First things first, turn on frame blending for your clip, just like I am. Once that's done, go to the search bar and type in Twixter and then add it onto your clip. Once you have added it on, just copy the settings that I'm doing right here. I try to make them a little bit bigger just so you guys could see them better. And yeah. After you've done that, right click on your mouse or keyboard to pre-compose your clip. Now add on Twixter again and do those exact same settings I showed you last time, but this time you're going to want to change the speed to whatever you prefer. I made mine 20 because my clip was a little bit short and I needed to slow it down so it would fill the whole duration. So yeah. <laughs> You're going to have to wait a few seconds for the clip to render through fully so you get that full effect and then once it has, you will see the final result and it honestly, it's so worth it no matter how long it takes to render through because it'll end up looking so, so nice and yeah. And yeah, that was it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and comment down below any tutorial requests you guys may have and yeah, I love you guys. Bye!